I am better with things that are dangerous. They hold my attention better. My dad raised me as an adrenaline junkie. We live next to Cedar Point. Yeah. So I've been on roller coasters and thrill rides since I was old enough to, or tall enough to get on them. So it's, it's what I do, it's what I like. As far as I can ever remember, I told my mom I was going to work with sharks. It's just like any little kid, I like dinosaurs. And when I saw the first megalodon, that was it. I like sharks. Okay. I, I didn't care about dinosaurs anymore. Yeah. And then. I think the one that freaked my dad out, I came home with a giant snapping turtle. And like, I had no idea that it was like a dangerous, dangerous turtle. I was like, oh, it's a turtle. You know, and I, I remember like I had walked like down the road with it and walked up our driveway with it. And then I had pulled out, he had thawed a whole pound of hamburger for dinner. And I was like, oh, it likes the hamburger. And I fed it like the whole pound of hamburger. <laughs> my dad was so mad at me. I think it's really rewarding, like, when you do see people's faces light up, like, if you do see them have, like, that moment where you can tell, like, they were touched by something, or they um, were super excited about something that they learned or saw, or they had been like, oh, I read about that, and I just saw them do that behavior, and it's neat, and it was so My mom babysat when I was little, most of my life, so I love kids, um, and I have three young nieces, so seeing them come in here and their reaction to all the things that I've worked so hard to do and plus you know all this all the yeah all this all the school kids you know answering questions seeing them kids who've never seen a shark before because their parents don't have money to take them to the ocean and to come here and see some large animals so I like that the most